Okay, you're gonna have you're gonna get three strings. I what I did was I stretched the string all the way out as far as my arms would go, and I counted to five each one, and then I I went like maybe five and a quarter out on the last one, and I cut the hair to where it's in eight pieces, so you can calculate how you how you're gonna do that, and then I just take three strings, and then I'm gonna start braiding. Okay, so I'm just going to part it. I'm going to keep these in her hair for about a month. She cut her locks off. Both of my daughters had locks, but she didn't want locks anymore. So this is her protective style. I'm going to do uh, some type of braid to her hair every month. Braid style. So this is her first one. If you look at the last video I uploaded, uh... It's showing how we moisturize our hair before we did this. Before I parted it. Because as you can see, moisturizing it with coconut oil is very beneficial. Because coconut oil is, uh, to me, is more beneficial than just putting water. But if you don't have coconut oil, the next best thing is water. Ready? Okay. So I'm going to start braiding it now. I put three, I'm braiding it with three strings. And I stretch the strings out five times as far as my uh, my arms would reach to make the the strands. Okay, and this is four C hair. Okay, and uh, yeah. I don't braid perfect, y'all. Only sometimes. <laughs> I can plait though, but this braiding thing, honey. As long as her hair is protected, she don't really care, and I don't either. You doing your, your chin up? <laughs> Very simple, honey. I just took too long. <laughs> That's what happens when you always got stuff to do. She's gonna complete putting, finish putting the beads in it, and <clears throat> yeah, cause she can do that herself, boo. Right, little. <laughs>